Well, does anybody see flickering of lights in my room here? Right there and here and everywhere. It isn't the pixelation on my camera. It's absolutely a spiritual dressing that's dropping down in into my room. So when I speak out into the field, you'll see something change. But anyways, in the advent of that, I say this many, many times, as I speak into my window, you'll see it reverberate. And as I talk, you'll be able to see flicks of light and flashes and all kinds of stuff going on. Um, I know who I am and who said it first. At 40 years old, he came in and quickened my soul. A spirit came into my body and said, a life for a life. At one prayer, I prayed into my heart at eight years old. For 33 years after that, until I turned 40, I wandered and wavered, went to the school system of the public, Pittsburgh public school system, and it was the Wolves. Greek for school system that isn't run in the same understanding in accordance with anything of relationship building and understanding what it is to be created in the image and likeness of God and to be in the will to build and thrive on life. In life, on life, over it, omniscient, and the understanding of what Jesus was trying to teach us in the first place. He comes to Abraham's people. He says, here I am. Is it not written? We are supposed to be God amongst ourselves. And they said, blasphemy, blasphemy, and wanted to stone him. The meaning of it, if I just change it just a little bit, if we were all godly, amongst ourselves, to be God to one another. When I was a child, I was smashing ants on my front porch. I was smashing them with my finger and a voice came into my head then through thought. And I remember this clearly now. And it said, the voice, if you were God and that was you, would you want to be treated this way? And I stopped and I thought about it and I realized how fragile life is. So, in and of itself, nothing is observed or learned without watching and growing up in morality. We learn how to navigate by popularity and all kinds of stuff when we go to school. Also, violence, gangster image, drug culture, they set this captive free into recovery. I'm really hoping for some change for change. My address is 738 Horning Street, Pittsburgh, PA, 15210. My name is Dennis Saunders with the Lord Jesus Christ. There's no coincidence. Sound it out. Coincidence. Spell it. It's coincide, Dennis. At one point in time, there was another man named Dennis Christos who had an orb that he carved because he read the Book of Wisdom and was able to whittle. He was on a ship, and he had a different of opinion over throughout the years on how many times a spiritual judgment came upon the earth or absolutely to come and help somebody or bring the truth, an exodus, an explanation owed to us. Just to say and prove that I really am quickened in spirit, the quickened one. Buddha was anointed, or Buddha was awakened. He said, seek the truth. Jesus came, he was anointed, he was the truth. The son of man also known as Toth was the truth in Egypt. Going way back, way, way back, there's all kinds of stuff that goes into the God of the mountain, God of the valley, and it's all repeated, repetitive throughout history and mankind. And the meaning of Jesus, the reason why he took that name instead of Emmanuel, which is in a, in a man everlasting, God is with us, was Jesus, or Yeshua, the meaning of he and us, the creator and image and likeness of us, was one of the first understandings of all time in the Bible. So, G, yea, he, and us. God bless everybody. I hope everybody can pick up the willpower to overcome addiction.